Speaking of fast, this is the fastest trailer trailer for the trailer I've ever seen. No impressive shots, no punchy dialogue, no celebrity cast list, just this. A title card warning me that this is my last chance to turn back. Even the trailer people are judging us for watching their trailer. Yikes. Now, I've heard a lot of complaints about this Sonic movie, including from people who created Sonic, saying his legs are way too long, how his gloves are missing, replaced with skin that's weirdly discolored. Well, first of all, there's nothing wrong with a leg that's long. But you know what bothers me the most? The speed of sound is 767 miles per hour, yet this so-called Sonic the Hedgehog is 7 miles under target. If he's not Sonic, and he's clearly not a hedgehog, what is he? I know what he is. He's a criminal. I'm horrified, not only because it's 2019 and Sonic is still somehow using a tape player, but because what even is this? Is this where he lives? This is a disaster. Who needs this many shoes? I nominate this hedgehog den as the worst superhero lair of 2019. Endgame has nothing on this hog pocalypse. Is this really the time to show off your long, long legs and your off brand hands? You're in the middle of a highway. Pull yourself together. Gotta go fast. Twenty minutes ago, an energy surge knocked out power across the entire Pacific Northwest. This needs someone who can figure out exactly what we're dealing with. You're not suggesting who I think you're suggesting. We have no choice. Something tells me this man is not an electrical engineer with extensive knowledge of power delivery infrastructure in the Pacific Northwest. Though, though it is typical of the US government to pick the least qualified person for the job. So I guess that's realistic, at least. What the? Are you in charge here? Yes, I am. Nope! My Wrong. I'm Wrong. I'm in charge. Allow me to clarify. In a sequentially ranked hierarchy based on level of critical importance, the disparity between us is too vast to quantify. I hate him already. He hasn't even done anything evil yet. I just hate that line so much. But on the other hand, literally, on the other hand, I really do like his gloves. Are these the phone touchscreen gloves? At least someone is wearing stylish on-brand handwear. Agent Stone, the doctor thinks you're basic. Listen, pal, I don't know if you realize- I'm sorry, Major, what was your name? It's on his shirt, it was on the back of his hat. Why do we trust this man with electricity? I don't even trust him to read. Benny. Nobody cares! SFPD! Uh, meow? <laughs> So apparently he's fast enough to travel near the speed of sound, but too slow to escape this tranquilizer dart, which seems to be made out of the hair of a female Sonic. To be clear, to be clear, I'm not saying that pink equals female, I'm just saying Hollywood lacks creativity. Hashtag make Sonic gay. Oh, come on. Okay, pal, I want answers. Basically, it looks like I'm gonna have to save your planet. Again, if this hog is so fast, why is he traveling in just some random car? He isn't even 30 years old yet. He needs to wait at least 10 more years before he can get his midlife crisis pickup truck. Oh, is that all you got? No, but thank you for asking. Uh oh. Whatever this creature is, our job is to secure it. Now, I'm no geography expert, but this is not how Idaho, Montana, and Utah work. These are not borders that exist in the real world. Utah and Montana do not share a border. What is going on here? Neutralize it. Let's see what makes it tick. Yeah, go ahead. Lick that high voltage hair. That's definitely required to fix our power grid. Do you think Paramount was like, well, this is a Sonic movie, so obviously we need a producer who specializes in fast! Look at this! I 
took nine million steps today. Sonic has been around for nearly 30 years, during which I feel like no one has really sat down to ask the uncomfortable yet important question, how many characteristics exactly does Sonic share with a hedgehog? I'm so confused about this film.